did you guys know, did you know that the former chief of the Israeli defense staff four months ago compared the situation of the Palestinians in the West Bank to that of the Jews in Nazi Germany? Because in Nazi, not the genocide, that's not what he was talking about. He was talking about before the war, where the Nazi branchers, the thugs, could attack Jews and destroy Jewish homes and 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 and, and shops and and assault Jews without impunity. When the police showed up, they supported the Nazis. And the former ch deputy chief of the Israeli Defense Staff said, "We're doing the same thing to the Palestinians. When the settlers show up to harass and even kill." Palestinians in the West Bank, the army shows up to protect the settlers. And this year, before October the 7th, over 250 Palestinians had been killed by the army and the settlers in the West Bank, including children. This stuff is not reported in the Western press. It's not look, I used to be a Zionist, and nor can we move forward if the present occupation and the suppression of the Palestinians continue. Well, how about returning the land that's been stolen from the Palestinians? Now, we keep talking about the Hamas Charter. Did you know that the Likud Charter, the ruling part in Israel, excludes a Palestinian entity west of the Jordan River? So let's get rid of both charters, and let's start with the basis of recognition and peace and the ending of this unspeakably brutal occupation. Piers, you have to go there to see it for yourself, yeah. as I have, and you would cry every day.